Hey everybody, Case here, back at it with more personal prizes in the Springfield Zoo event. We are halfway home to our goal of getting the final prize in the entire update. <laughs> but first, we gotta get Mad Dr. Hibbert. Hey, you! Does anyone know who that is? Humans are my favorite animal. <laughs> Mad Dr. Hibbert! Now before we dive into his character, obviously, and look at all the different things that we normally do, I thought it'd be a little bit interesting to do something a little bit different. Mad Dr. Hibbert first appeared in the Trios of Horrors 13, Season 14, Episode 1. The entire episode was actually a parody of H.G. Wells' An Island of Dr. Morrow, which was written in 1896. And in a particular episode, the different Simpsons characters end up getting actually turned into different hybrid animals, like Mr. Burns, who is a fox, on Dr. Matt Hibbert's shoulders. The entire episode actually plays out while all the characters in that particular episode become animals. So hopefully you enjoyed that. I thought there'd be an interesting way of doing things. Maybe we'll start doing that in the future. We'll see. Let me know down below. So I'm still missing well, a bunch of characters, obviously. A lot of them are premium characters. Except for you there. Second last. My voice is great. Run! Hyena sharks have escaped! Ah! Jaws with paws! Jaws with paws. There has to be someone in this town with a pure zoo loving heart. When I was a kid, I loved all animals, big and small, wild and free, caged and sedated. Why don't I take some of Homer's DNA, then clone and gestate another him? to his teenage days. You really lost it, haven't you, Doc? <laughs> uh, my voice is like so like not deep. Make Homer submit his DNA? Unlock Teenage Homer. The Teenage Homer obviously will be the final prize in the update. Welcome to my island. Bernice, I'll be home late and I've got a project that needs my attention. We were supposed to have dinner with the Simpsons tonight. I see the Simpsons every day. They're the most sick and injured people in town. Fine, Julius. I'll see you at home. Make Mad Dr. Hibbert go to Hibbert family practice. Do I want to do that? Welcome to my island. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Go to family practice. All in the name of progress. Oh, so it looks like we have Cletus now. <coughs> Hey, Doc, I found another one of you to run some tests on. Professor, it is nice to see you join us. I, I still don't know why I'm here with all the pipe itch, barrettes, and flavor and marve, maven. It's okay, Professor. I can prepare you for what comes next. You'll have to beg my pardon. <laughs> Mad Dr. Hibbert, unpardon the turkey. Welcome to my island. So this is a part where he turns the professor into a turkey and then actually cuts him like a Thanksgiving turkey. And he goes bye-bye. Yes, completely mad about providing top-notch vacation values. Oh, hey, I'm dying. Oh, haha, gobble, 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 dead. So he's gonna just chomp on him for a little bit there, four hours. There'll be nothing left, obviously. Looks like we're switching back to Dr. Hibbert. I'm sorry, Mad Dr. Hibbert. Welcome to my island. I need more test subjects, but I don't think that Hill Hick Cletus will be able to lure anyone else. Why don't I wait to get the drunk fellas for Moe's? I was wrong about you, Cletus. You're brilliant. Go to Moe's! Welcome to my island. In the name of progress. Off he goes. I see. So now we're going to Moe's. Whoa! Let me get this straight. We all get an island vacation just for participating in your test? The rewards are great, and the risks are only moderately high. Eh, what's the worst that could happen? Sudden death? <laughs> I don't know how he laughs. <laughs> Sign me up, Doc. I love the islands. 
I hate beaches, cause the sand gets everywhere. But if Lenny's doing it, I'm in too. Perfect. Meet me at the Springfield Nuclear Power Plant tomorrow after work. Address the crowd! That sounds animated. Welcome to my island. And it is! It's an eight hour quest. Address the crowd. Yes, completely mad. About providing top notch vacation values. So clearly we have to get the burnt fox down the road as well, right? Great speech. Amazing speech. I absolutely love it. The question is though, how is this going to play out in the end? Are you better off now than you were as human? I think that's a big enough sample size for human trials. Oh no! Is William going to shut it down? Uh oh. Stop right there, mad doctor. Hey chief, how's that knee been treating you? Oh, it's good. Really good. Thanks for asking. He's just trying to distract you, Chief. Don't you think I'd know that, Lou? Hey, where'd he go? Hide at the Simpsons' house. Welcome to my island. All in the name of progress. Off he goes, hey, Springy. So this is basically, I think, where it's going to end off. I've sped up enough quests. This is essentially it. He tries to do his thing. Doesn't look like it's going to happen, just he's going to hide out. And that's pretty much all she wrote. So that is Dr. Oh, sorry, Mad Dr. Hibbert. And now, I have to wait until I can get the teenage home, but there are two things in the way. Sanctuary grants, free land token. Hmm, don't like it. But they would just go away and just have teenage homer. So Teenage Homer is going to take probably towards the end of the update, eight and a half days as a recording of this video, but I will definitely have it out for you when I get a chance to get it unlocked. Once again, did you like what I did in the very beginning while I provided a little background? If you did enjoy that though, please let me know because it's just something I kind of thought of just right as I was going to record it. And if people like it, I will definitely do that moving forward for other prizes down the road. So thank you everybody so much for watching. If you guys have enjoyed this video, please remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. My name is Casey, and I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye, guys.